Hey Cupcakes! Today's video is going to be my birthday haul because today is my birthday and you will probably be getting this today and I'm sorry that it is a Thursday video instead of a Tuesday video but Tuesday kind of fell through because I was traveling to go see my parents for my birthday week because I wanted to come here to be with my boyfriend for my birthday and the video I had, it was going to be uploaded, but then my editor at my parents' house crashed. And so now we're on this day, and I'm just going to put both of them together, or this, or we'll just see. But today's video will be everything I got for my birthday. And so let's just get right into it, and let's go. So the first thing I guess I will go with is the first two things in front of me, which are plushies. I got a plushie from Luke's mom, if y'all don't know who Luke is, Luke is my boyfriend that I did two videos with, I believe, I'll put them in the description below, but this is Mist, and it's part of the Halloween plushies that came out, but I told her that I really, really wanted it, and it could be my birthday present, and he is just freaking adorable, and now he sits with my cat shadow that Luke got me a while back as well. And the other plushie I have is Pusheen. I wanted something Pusheen related for a while now. I even saw the subscription box and almost caved in and bought a subscription just so I could get it. Especially when I saw the October one because they had a vinyl exclusive of Pusheen with bat wings. And I was just like, oh my god, I needed it. It's so cute and creepy. So, me and my dad, when we saw each other for my birthday, went to the mall, and we went in, like, every store, and then we went into Claire's, and a couple places had Pusheens, but only Claire's had the birthday one with the cupcake and the candle and all that, so I told him this is the one I wanted for my birthday, obviously, so I have him now, and he is super squishy and fluffy, and I love it. Okay, the next things are going to be stuff that Luke got me for my birthday. I am so thankful for the stuff that he got me. I was not expecting the stuff he did give me. I expected a couple things that he gave me because I've been sitting there agging on about it that I've been wanting it and wanting it to get back into this hobby. And so he bought them for me, but then I got an unexpected gift that I absolutely love and I will get a lot of use out of because I feel so bad that he got it even though I said that he didn't have to. So, with that being said, the thing that he got that I wasn't expecting him to get, but I was thankful he did, was the Alice in Wonderland makeup palette. The, this is the new movie for Alice because they actually came out with the first movie as well. This is the Urban Decay Disney Alice Through Looking Glass eyeshadow palette and it just looks like this. And the eyeshadows are like that on the back. And the eyeshadows are Alice, Mud Hatter, Miranda, Erasabeth, Time, Dream On, Bandersnatch, Duchess, Gone Mad, Reflection, Door, Mouse, Paradox, Kingdom, Salas and Grum, Chronosphere, Mirror, Royal Flush, Chessboard, Cake, and Metamorphosis. So I have a ton of eyeshadows to choose from and I would show this in the video, but if y'all want a separate video just all about this makeup palette and swatches and makeup tutorial, just let me know in the comments below and I will do that for you guys because I am excited to dip into this and try to create makeup tutorials with it. So, And I actually swatched these when this first came out at Ulta and they are all very but buttery and very pigmented, so I am very excited to play with this. Now the other thing he got me was perler beads. So I did this a long time ago. I used to always create these things and I've been wanting to dabble back into it and start making like ornaments and keychains and like picture frames and like big objects that you can build and stuff like that because Pinterest is like my home website I'm always on all the time and I pinned one thing about perler beads and then they always recommend you for more things so then I just fell down the rabbit hole of finding all the ideas you could make with perler beads and so now I'm like addicted to getting right back into it and Luke knew that I wanted to so he got me this 
one that has 4,000 beads in it. And it has 4,000 beads, three pegboards, two wiggle eyes. So I guess you can make little wiggle eye people. And then the ironing paper that you use to put it all together. And then the pattern sheets to show you which how to build each one on here. So it's actually got a lot of it in it, but it's a lot of perler beads. So I'll be getting really good use out of that. And then he bought me this pegboard that's like the biggest one they have. So I'll be definitely able to build a lot of bigger uh, objects instead of just the little tiny ones that normally you can get. But on top of that note, his grandma bought me the like small pack that you can buy, which is great because it also gives me more colors to choose from and more designs to build. And it has 8,500 beads, which is shocking to me because this is 4,000 and this is 8,500 in this little bitty box and then that giant box. But it has uh, 35 creations you can make and then it has the ironing paper and the instructions and then it has three little pegboards instead of a big one. So I am very excited to start building this stuff. And I might do, because I actually have a person on YouTube that I watch, she normally does like live streams and she'll do builds like this. I might do a video like that where it's a speed build of a big like picture of something. And so if y'all want that, also let me know down below that that's something y'all would want to watch and I will be glad to film it for you. Alright, and the last things that I got for my birthday, well it's besides showing this stuff, I got money from my grandmother and my aunt and then my mom is actually coming later for Thanksgiving and I'm going to get my birthday presents from her. So I'm actually really thankful for the things I've got. I didn't expect any of this, but the money that I got, I went ahead and went to work and bought my stuff. And if y'all didn't know, I work at a retailer. So I went and bought things and then I also got, because so, we had the employee sale, so I bought stuff for the employee sale and then I actually got employer of the month, so I got a... a opposite sale for me so this is all the stuff that I got and it's sad because I even have more stuff on hold for our next employee sale but this is everything I got this time and yeah a lot of it's for future events and like some of it's some Christmas stuff for other people but let's just jump right in because it's a lot. The first bag was I got this shirt because I was trying to find something to wear for my actual birthday but Everybody was at work pretty much anyway, so I just didn't really worry about it, but I really loved how this shirt was on, so I bought it. It's got the cold shoulder, like that, and it comes with like a little necklace that you can put on or you can not wear it. It's whatever. I have a shirt just like this as well. It's like a crop top, and it came with the necklace, but this is really comfortable, and it's really flowy and high in the front and low in the back, but it's looks really good on and I've been trying to get back more into my maroon colors because when it comes to fall time maroon and like really dark green is like my favorite colors to go to. The next thing is this beautiful thing that everybody thought I didn't need but we're doing uh, sweater pictures at work and I think it's adorable and I can probably have it for a couple years to last me and it's like one of a kind and it's this Christmas sweater and it's got jingles on it for the bells and then it also it lights up Ta -da! so yeah it lights up and I think it's very cute and I tried it on with a Christmas outfit that I'm going to try to wear and all the girls at work were like, oh my god, it's adorable, you have to get it. Even if you wear it for just a little bit, it'll be still worth it. And since I did the sale that I did, it was worth the money. And this was the three items for the 60% off sale that I got for employer of the month. And then the other stuff I'll show you is the 50% off. So this is the last item of the three items I got are boots, which I never ever find boots that I just fall in love with, but this is my first high boots I've ever had, I think for a very long time, 
and the other ones that I have right now have heels on them so they're really not that great but I wear them anyway and they're very tight and they go good with like the high low skirts but with this I can wear this with skirts or with boot cut jeans and they're just black and they have the little stocking at the top so it's really good for like skirts you can have just like the little peak like sock or whatever and they're really comfortable and the outfit I was telling y'all about with the sweater I tried with these boots and it looked really cute so the other stuff I got I bought this sweater for Luke's mom for a Christmas present and thankfully she doesn't watch these videos so she won't know but I got one as well, and I'm sure y'all have seen it in a video, but it's just the Pokemon sweater with, like, all the original Pokemons on it, so I bought that for her for Christmas. I bought these jogger sweatpants for me and Luke because I want to start working out or even just going every morning before he goes to work and I go to work on a walk and just spend time with each other and just be active together and so it's really cold now suddenly so my little spandex sweatpants are not going to be enough to keep me warm at these like really chilly mornings so I got these jogs. The next item I got was this suede skirt. Now Luke hates the feeling of these skirts like or this material I should say because it's like too soft. I don't, I don't know what his reasoning is for it, but I think they're very soft. And I need a skirt for another item in here to show off. So I opted for this skirt because I only have two other skirts that are short. And this is totally out of my comfort zone. But I bought, or I have like three tights in mind that I'm going to try to wear and try to be girly and wear skirts more and all of that jazz so that's this little skirt and I think it looks good with the full outfit and everything. Okay another item that I got was these sheet masks. Now I got these for Christmas presents and they're not like supposed to be serious they're supposed to be just like gag Christmas presents but they're supposed to be thoughtful so the reason why I bought them was because there is a, fr a uh, bear one a frog one, an otter one, and a sheep one. So, not just for the reason of what type of mask they are. I seriously only bought these because I love teddy bears, so that one's mine. My aunt loves frogs, so this one's hers. My sister-in-law loves otters, so she got this one. And then my mom, being the other one that I wanted to give one to, I got the last type of mask that we had, which was the sheep, so she gets this one. But I think it's adorable, and if they don't use it, that's okay. I will take it if they don't want to and use it for myself, but I just thought it'd be adorable because it's all of our favorite animals on a sheep mask, so yeah. Okay, I have two more items left to show you guys, and is the first one is this shirt. It is a blue ombre t-shirt and it's very comfortable. I could pr practically sleep in this shirt because it's so just laid back. But I really like how the ombre effect is. And like I said, I really like to do my jewel tone colors during the fall because it's just the very best time to do them. So I'm always about my emerald green and my dark blue and my maroons and dark reds. So that's that. And then my last thing I got, and the last of this haul of my birthday, is these kitty tights. Now, I think they're adorable, and then the fact that my friends were all talking about that they wanted to get them as well, opted me more to want them, and I got these, and they're just like knee-high tights, and then like the cat is on the knee, so hopefully they fit right and it does what it's supposed to because I normally have problems with tights like that that they don't go all the way up to the knee because my legs are all so long but fingers crossed they work out and so yeah. So with that being said that is everything that I got for my birthday and just to be a disclaimer because I know people do this every time they have to do a haul of anything 
I am not bragging by any means about what I got for my birthday. I am thankful for everything I got. I'm thankful for just even getting a happy birthday on my birthday and even a birthday car. That's all that matters to me. But I'm very thankful for everything and I will love everything and use everything and wear everything and just be very thankful for it. I'm glad that I made it to another year and now that I'm 24 and feel like I'm going on 40 and feeling like I'm just so old, but I'm really not. But I'm really glad that I have grown and learned a lot of things and now that I'm in a new relationship and like the happiest I've ever been and everything's just going really good for me. So that being said, I will see y'all in the next video and until then, stay sweet cupcakes. Bye!